The Round Rock ISD superintendent in the hot seat after a letter from a TEA monitor with the district recommends he be put on leave. In the letter given to the board back in December, it says, Place Round Rock Independent School District Superintendent Dr. Hafed Azaiz on paid administrative leave pending the outcome of an investigation regarding the underlying conduct found in a protective order issued by a Travis County District Court. The TEA tells Fox News this letter comes from an assault allegation against the superintendent. At this time, the school district says no criminal charges have been filed. The TEA monitor is also recommending an outside investigation take place. On Monday, the school board met to discuss the letter where they heard from over 90 minutes of public comment. Short and sweet, this needs to be looked into. That's it. Some residents urging the board to follow the letter. Now, I firmly believe in innocent until proven guilty. Now, due to the seriousness of the matter, I think that as a leader, you could, it's reasonable to assume that stepping down and um, uh, at minimum letting go on administrative leave is proper at this point. Others came out in support of the superintendent and are urging the board to wait till the investigation is over. While the allegations against Dr. A are concerning, they are just that, allegations. I can allege anything I want. Austin City Council member Mackenzie Kelly is also speaking out about the topic. She took to Twitter with concerns about the board meeting taking place at 2 o'clock. I'm a Round Rock ISD mom, and I'm disappointed this meeting is happening at a time where, like most parents, I'm working. I'm unable to attend the meeting due to my responsibilities at work. I sincerely hope that the school board follows the recommendations of the Texas Education Agency.